Okay, so E is for exceptional. There was a study done in Columbia University in 2006, and it tracked all the major profitable companies around America. They found out something very, very interesting. They found that 88% of the successful companies were the result of, listen to my words, exceptional execution of an ordinary idea. Let me say that again. 88% of the most profitable companies and breakthrough companies in the US were the result of exceptional execution of an ordinary idea. Now, the question is, how can you exceptionalize your insurance business? And I'm going to give you a tip in that respect. I want you to go home and write down every interaction that happens between yourself and your client. I want you to set standards for each of those interactions, from answering the phone to following up on leads, everything. And I want you to aim for, on a daily basis, to exceed the customer's expectations and to exceed the standards that you have set. Because you know something, again, this was mentioned earlier. I have learned that customers leave. There's no question about it. Every research study in the world shows you that. In fact, one research study said 96% of satisfied customers leave. But I'm also aware of the following, that friends never leave. And if I was to look at my business model, my business model is based on being authentic and developing real friendships, because friends never leave customers do. Okay? I want to tell you very quickly, very, very quickly, a story. I think Scott's a very good example of exceptionalizing an ordinary idea. I think it's fantastic the way he's done it. I want to tell you another example. There's this guy in Australia. I want you to raise your hand when you know what the business is. So you walk up to the door and you see a fantastic gold sign and it says by appointment only. You knock on the door, you walk into the room, and your eyes are immediately directed towards this huge cappuccino machine, huge coffee machine. And you actually smell the freshly baked buns that were actually baked on site. Baked on site. Do you know, do you know the business yet? Yeah? Bank. A bank? No. OK, I'll keep going. So, you go over, you decide to have your cup of coffee, you're directed to a lounge. Your name is on the lounge, and you're directed to your sofa with the latest magazines on the table, and you're allowed to drink a lovely cup of tea from very expensive China. Do you know, yes, what the business is? Shout it out anyway, we don't, we... Auto dealer. Not an auto dealer. A cafe? <laughs> that wouldn't be lateral thinking in my mind. OK, somebody might have got it. If you got it, meet me after this session, and I'm going to give you a book, OK? I'm serious. This guy then knocks on the door, comes in and sits down with the client. They work three days out of seven days. They are the most profitable in their occupation in Australia, a dentist. So the smell of bonds instead of the smell of antiseptic. Do you get me? So we all know none of us wants to rush into the dentist, so he's taught this through brilliantly. What I want you to do, because you have exceptional talent, because that's part of your DNA. Now I want you to go home and exceptionalize your business. How can you exceptionalize your business at each interaction with the customer?